What's happening, everybody? Jay Shockblast here, and <laughs> here it is. It is official. It is official. There's no other way to say it. Literally official. One of the biggest things that people have been holding on to for a very long time is the fact that Warner Brothers, TT Games, whoever you want to call it, had not officially announced anything in regards to LEGO Dimensions. We've been telling you, uh, a lot of us have been telling you for months and months and months, doesn't look good. There have been articles written, especially by Dan from BricksToLife.com, uh, about this is done. Everything behind the scenes says it's done. You know, Eurogamer finally kind of forced their hand last week. In my video, I know I made a video about this last week, and I basically said, I don't think that they're ever going to acknowledge it because they don't have to. I think it's just going to stop and people are going to slowly forget about it. But I have to say kudos to Warner Brothers for not allowing that to happen. So you've probably been reading this statement on the screen. I'm not going to do any fancy gameplay behind it this time. I'm just going to talk over this one screenshot. Uh, Warner Brothers Interactive Entertainment, TT Games, and the LEGO Group would like to thank fans for the ongoing support of LEGO Dimensions. After careful consideration, we will not be producing new expansion packs for the game beyond what is now available. We will continue to provide ongoing server and customer support for all LEGO Dimensions packs. Existing packs will continue to work interchangeably and will remain available for purchase. So that's it. No more. Everything that's out is it. Um, you know, and I'm, I'm it sucks. Like, I loved this game, as I've said before, and I will always say, uh, this game was phenomenal. It brought so many amazing franchises together that I never thought was possible. And I think, uh, you know, there was a place for LEGO Dimensions, and there still is a place for LEGO Dimensions as far as I'm concerned, just not in a Toys to Life, you know, form. Uh, I really, really would love to advocate them finding a way to re-release the game with all of the characters just as a normal LEGO game. I guarantee you if they sold it that way, they would uh, reinvigorate life in the franchise and it would sell like hotcakes. At this point, I can't imagine it being really all that complicated for them, you know? And they could also unlock all the background characters as playable. I don't know how much really goes into it. You don't have to worry about tons of voiceover work for them. You don't have to go crazy giving them all sorts of abilities. Just release them as playable. All the Sonic background characters, Tails, Knuckles, Shadow, you know, all of them, you know, all the Scooby-Doo characters, all the, you know, uh, Adventure Time characters, you know, everybody would be so cool to just be able to go into a big grid and access all those characters as playable. I think that's what a lot of people really wanted, and it's what I would really hope they could find a way to do. If they ever decide to do a LEGO Dimensions 2, uh, also should not be Toys to Life, and uh, I would hope that to make Lego happy, uh, they were able to, you know, release those blind packs. That was my, those were my two big ideas that I had for making Lego Dimensions viable moving forward. Uh, whether or not they do that, I don't know. I doubt it, but, um, you know, at least we got the game that we did because the game that we did was phenomenal and, and TT Games, like, you guys were great. So awesome. Sorry it came to this, but it's official and nothing we can do about it. So, uh, there's your official confirmation, and, uh, you know, there have been some people that have been, uh, if I could be honest, pretty pretty terrible uh, to the people that were just telling it like it is, and uh, I hope those people have a miserable day, because, you know, it was all there, and now it's official, and you're a terrible person. And I, I, I have to get, I have to include this because there were some terrible people saying and doing terrible things uh, towards anybody that said, hey, look, this is going to happen. And uh, they, they deserve to be admonished. Um, you know, I understand. But uh, at the same time, you know, you live by your decisions. So that's it. Turn out the lights. We'll see you.